History is created in Australia with CoinSpot listing gold standard and silver standard on their platform. What does this mean? Stick around to find out. G'day crypto goers, I'm Adam Stokes. Welcome back or to the channel. A very exciting article again from Ainsley Bullion where we learn that Australia's most popular crypto exchange, CoinSpot, listed gold and silver backed tokens, gold standard and silver standard. This is a groundbreaking development for investors in precious metals and crypto traders alike. Australian precious metal investors now have the ability to trade gold and silver 24 hours a day, 7 days a week from anywhere in the world. These trades can be of any size, requiring no pickup, receiving or storing of bullion and are at low margins compared to directly buying bars or coins. Gold and Silver Standard don't only provide a safe, secure and cost-effective platform for investors, but also act as a stable coin for crypto traders to park profits between trades without going to Aussie dollars or a fiat currency tether. Simply swap, say your Bitcoin, for Gold Standard on CoinSpot at 1am Saturday night whilst on holidays in Bali. This means you can completely avoid fiat currency and bank risk even if that is a proxy like USDT where the USD funds are purportedly held in a bank. Regular traders will know about gold standards and silver standards but here's a quick snapshot of what they are. Each token is backed 100% by real physical gold and silver bullion already vaulted in reserve vault, insured by the world's largest insurer and verified by BDO. This is all done in the high regulatory geopolitically safe environment of Australia. Each AUS gold standard and AGS silver standard token equals one gram of each metal with their price pegged to the spot price of each metal. The tokens are ERC20 tokens, meaning they are hosted on the ultra-secure, cost and time-efficient Ethereum blockchain. The goldsilverstandard.com website provides anyone, anywhere, the ability to see how many tokens are created via the publicly accessible and immutable blockchain ledger and how many grams of bullion bars are held, including the serial number for each bar. BDO then verifies that independently each quarter. Some of the commentary on social channels last night after the launch was around the spreads of silver. This is not new to regular bullion traders, but is worth addressing again so everyone understands. Silver does indeed have a larger spread than gold, and a larger spread than ordinarily seen on most cryptocurrencies. Most of the spread in trading precious metals is in refining, bullion production, and handling costs before any margin on sale. With the gold to silver ratio at a near all-time high of 88, you can imagine that the cost of production as a percentage of the value of the metal varies greatly between gold and silver when the cost of actually producing the bars is relatively similar. In other words, the cost of producing, say, a kilo bar is not hugely different, but when applied as a percentage against one being, say, $860 and the other being $72,000, we see much bigger variances in percentage terms. On top of that, silver is more expensive to refine, more expensive to transport, and more expensive to store. The reason for that is that it's actually worth less. So you're digging out a commodity out of the ground and refining it and moving it, but per gram, it's worth much less. And that's why when I'm buying gold and silver, on one hand, it's good to have lots of silver bars because in, say, a case of Armageddon, when I'm giving out my silver bars to buy a loaf of bread, it's easier to do in the sense I don't have to shave off a microgram of it as I would with gold to get a loaf of bread or a bottle of water. But the downside of silver is that if I have to move in haste and get away from wherever I am and I want to take silver stores with me, I physically have to take heavier amounts of precious metal with me, which is a logistical burden because I'm physically carrying something bigger that is worth less. The article goes on. The spread below spot for buybacks allows for refining and repouring old bars or on selling and freight to refiners who also pay less than spot on the wholesale basis. Whilst these tokens enjoy lower spreads than you would ordinarily pay for bars or coins from a bullion dealer, they are backed by real bullion that must be bought and sold and hence subject to the same market dynamic described above. Whilst higher than gold, 
The same historically high gold-silver ratio, GSR, compared to a 100-year average of around 45, and the maths of reversion of the mean, has some investors unconcerned by the relatively small extra spread. CoinSpot is famous for its easy-to-use and secure platform, and for the record, I am not being paid by CoinSpot to write this. However, I do endorse CoinSpot in the sense that I have been using it for over two years. I have never had an issue with it. It is Australian based. I have spoken to the people over the phone and via email at CoinSpot and I'm very comfortable using them. And if you want to get involved with CoinSpot, use the link in the description below to ensure a secure sign up of CoinSpot, which I'll take you to in a second. But to close off this article, it says, of course, you can still buy and sell over the counter OTC through Ainsley Wealth for a person-to-person -person experience or high-value trades up to 10 million, together with the sought-after completely cold Ainsley crypto wallet, giving you the highest standard of security for your tokens. So going over to CoinSpot, let's check this out. Here is coinspot.com.au. Again, if you want to join this site, I do recommend it. Link below. The reason why this article is big and this is historic is because here we have a typical crypto exchange and you can see all the coins listed here and remember no exchange as far as i know has every single coin ever created at one time so if you want to buy lots of coins different coins you typically have to be on different exchanges but what i like about CoinSpot is that it is very secure it is approved by the commonwealth of australia that is it's completely legal you have to go through the correct procedures of registering your account to legally buy sell and trade cryptos and looking down the list here as we go lower it's all cryptocurrencies but there is a big difference right at the bottom of the list that we can see for the very first time and note there are a fair few coins on this site which is great they're always adding coins to this site sometimes they're taking some away that's when coins collapse and you take them off the site but right at the bottom there it is gold standard and silver standard this is historic so if you're not familiar with buying and selling gold for me when i buy and sell gold i typically do it through perth and it sends me gold and silver real gold and silver that i then have to store and secure in person but the pain with that is that i have to store and secure that silver which costs money and takes up space and i have to put layers of security on my property and around that silver and gold to make sure it's secure of course so the downside of buying gold and silver in person that is actually buying the physical gold and silver typically i buy from perthmint.com that you're looking at right now is that when i'm buying gold and silver here i can only buy when the markets are open and i have that gold and silver sent to me directly so as a result i have a couple of limitations one i physically have to store that gold and silver which costs time and money through picking up or collecting that gold and silver when it comes via registered and secure post and then i have to store it in a secure facility with a fair layer of security around it for obvious reasons. But the other downside of buying directly through somewhere like perthmint.com, of which I do have a video made out there if you want to look at how to do this, is that I can only do it when the shop is open. That is, I can only buy here when the markets are open. And let me just show you quickly what I mean there. So here I want to, as an example, buy gold and silver on a weekend, and I can't, because it says it's now closed. And what they mean by it's now closed is that the market is asleep. Because these prices are always going up and down, and just like traditional stocks, part of the reason why I like crypto so much is I've been trading in traditional stocks, as I call them. I've been buying traditional stocks pretty much my entire adult life, and I can only do that when the market is open. And the same applies for gold and silver. Here we are, it's a weekend, I want to buy gold and silver, and I can't. I can't because the market is closed, and you can only buy when it's open, because the prices are so dynamic. Now, of course, in crypto, you can buy anytime, anywhere. Crypto doesn't sleep. The market is always awake, because it is non-centralized, and no one owns it as such. It's just a algorithm that is running anytime, anywhere, and as this article was talking about from Ainsley Bullion, we can now do that in gold. So comparative to buying gold and silver, besides the physical aspects of storing it, even though you can on this site store it virtually, here over at coinspot.com.au, we can see I could buy this right now. In fact, let's do it very quickly just for fun because I think I've got some money in the account. How much have I got to spend? Here you go, I've got 76 cents in my account. Let's see if I can buy 50 cents of a gold standard. Here we go, buy, this is history being created. Total of 50 cents I'm buying, first time ever online on a Sunday afternoon with a coin spot fee of 0.005 of a cent. Confirm the buy and bang, congratulations. That's I've just created history with you guys. I've just bought gold. On a Sunday afternoon, 50 cents worth. If we go back to my wallets, I should now be able to see something in my gold wallet. I should be able to see 
50 cents worth of gold and there it is I have 50 cents worth of gold and then if I wanted to sell that just like crypto I could sell that straight away this is exciting stuff this means I can buy and sell gold and silver instantly anywhere at any time of any quantity again comparative to buying gold and silver on this site the minimum I can buy is 1 20th of an ounce which is $110 typically when I'm buying gold or silver I normally go for the ounce bars whereas on CoinSpot I can now do it just like a crypto and I'm guessing I could even buy five cents in fact I'm even going to put my money where my mouth is and see if I can buy five cents worth of gold so when people are saying they can't afford Bitcoin because it's ten thousand dollars well I say we'll buy five cents worth of Bitcoin now we can see let's try and buy five cents worth of gold press buy confirm buy and yes I've just bought five cents worth of gold standard this is exciting stuff well done to CoinSpot again if you want to join this site please go through my link below it doesn't make any difference to your joining of the site but it will help me help you and it also ensures you're not going through a shadow site and you get a secure login as I understand it this site is currently only for Australian and potentially our good friends over the pond in New Zealand but in any case exciting times in crypto where the power of crypto platforms are now flowing over to traditional markets such as gold and silver and you're able to buy seemingly no minimum possibly no maximum trading anytime anywhere backed by the regulatory power that is the commonwealth of australia well done to all those who have invested in this project thanks for listening happy investing and i'll talk to you next time <laughs>